Where do I begin? Indonesia felt like a place we had been to many times before, just not in a waking state. As fantastical as this might sound, what we found here was quite literally the stuff dreams are made of. Indonesia is so vast that it's difficult to bundle it under the umbrella of just one country. With its some 18,000 islands, the entire world is waiting to be discovered. Our limited exploration of Bali, Java and Sumatra during our previous adventure serves as a striking reminder that we merely scratched the surface. It would take multiple lifetimes to fully explore the wealth of wonders this country has to offer. Indonesia Can I carry you? Let's go. There's something truly magical about witnessing the sunrise from a boat. But that's not all we're here for. Can I tell you my secret dolphin call? I feel like it's moments like these that remind us to do more with our time here. Oh my god! Whoa! What's happening? Um, Bodhi needs to go pee, and when you gotta go, you gotta go, right? So, uh... <laughs> there are only a few things in life that never get old, and one of those is dolphins. Are you ready to get in? The dolphins are right over there. <laughs> and we're gonna be hanging off these ropes. Let's go, Bodhi! It reminds me of Waterworld. Kevin Costner fishing himself. My board east, get undone. Uh, oh, Dolphins, Dolphin, right in front of us. Hurry up. Okay, I'm ready. Okay, left. Ready? Ready? Go. Go. Dolphins, and suddenly, we were in their world. You see dolphins? <laughs> Buddy, do you want to go on a waterfall hike with Papa? Yes! yes. That's why it's just me and you. Okay, see you guys soon. Bye! Buddy, it's getting louder. Yes, a lot, buddy. I think we have a slight obsession with vehicles that can go places, others cannot. So 
like a safari car. Uh, he's modding it, isn't he? Which comes in real handy when exploring the new and old lava fields of an active volcano. See that rock you're standing on? <coughs> yes, I was going to show us something with that. Oh. What do you think is underneath us? Lava. I think it's there's a lava. big lava cave. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> I made a map this way to get to the volcano. Unbelievable. It's just yeah, endless bro. fields. Before the lava here, before the eruption, Batur village was here in this area. The special thing there is the lava is not coming in in that area, only that area. And the place which is now the big tree over there, it was a temple. No. How is this possible? There is a wall of lava. Almost as tall as these yeah, trees. Yeah, yeah, if you yeah, it's hard to fathom how a 30 foot wall of lava would stop lava. and navigate around. It's not just that it stopped there, but it goes mm -hmm. on for another mile. <coughs> Unbelievable. We've got the best purple <laughs> pillows. <laughs> <laughs> Cody just found the coolest part of the rice terraces. A caterpillar! Look! Wow! Are you nervous? No. Based on the number of buckles around you, maybe you should be nervous. <laughs> Why do you have a slingshot? Uh, this the monkey, the uh, one aggressive, just the things up. Not the um, stone. No? No, what just the wire. Just the noise? Yes. <laughs> so do we need that? Can you bring that with us? Yeah. Okay. Liv, do not touch the monkeys, okay? I'll touch the rice people when I'm yeah. a monkey. You are a monkey, <laughs> and they'll know. going on? What is yeah. Mama doing? This little bite is on my face. <laughs> <laughs> you okay? <laughs> that was a little scary. <laughs> okay, show your hands everyone. Show Bodhi, your hands. show your hands. Bodhi, show Girl, say nothing in your hands. That was terrifying. <laughs> I had to put on my brave face and I don't think I did very well, but I tried so that the kids didn't freak out. Watch out, you're gonna step on one. Oh. There are little monkeys baby everywhere. Monkey. Hi, baby Cody, monkey. It's like you, little baby monkey. Woody, what is he giving you? Have a 700 monkey. 700 monkeys. 700 monkeys. They have three different families. Different families. Do you hear the noises? It's calling for a drama. Okay, usually the only animal we feed is our dog, but we were enlightened that these monkeys depend on tourists and the guides for food due to their urban forest habitat. I think you're So they don't go out raiding the local villages. So our guide just taught the kids how to call the monkeys and they all started calling and then hundreds of monkeys started appearing out of the woods right at us and here we are. This isn't terrifying at all. They're everywhere. 
he doesn't want to get down. <laughs> he's like, I'm good here. He's comfy, he's tall. It's like a tree. <laughs> When I see those monkeys, it's like gazing into the reflection of our untamed kin. And you know what? Judging by how carefree their lives appear, maybe we made a mistake ditching the trees. And that was it, the last one. That's it. The next morning, I snuck out by myself hoping to witness the Hindu sunrise ritual practiced by many across Bali. Little did I know that I would end up being welcomed and invited to share breakfast with one of the local families. These are moments that don't always make it on camera, but let this be said, the people of Indonesia are hands down some of the kindest and most welcoming souls we have encountered anywhere. I just left their home and I'm still in, in shock and awe that this would happen, that someone would invite me like this into their home. I mean, it's such a Balinese and such a uh, non-Western thing to feel like people just like connection and sharing each other's culture in a way, right? But yeah, I'm absolutely inspired and over the moon. It's incredible. Next up, the land of volcanoes, Java. a.m. Time to hit Mount Bromo. Bodhi, yeah. do you know what we're doing this morning? I'm going to go up on the cave. <coughs> yeah. mm. We're doing this. Look, there's so many jeeps. So many jeeps, here they come. so crazy. This is insane. What are we going to do if the volcano erupts while we're up here? You run it back down, get in your car, zoom away, call a police to stop it and put a gate there. That's a solid emergency plan. Did you get that, Birdie? <laughs> no! Time to descend into the sea of sands. It's usually a bad sign when everyone else is going that way. And we are going this way. No, that door! Are you going to be driving? Yeah. Okay, let's go. <laughs> Pretend like you're you're holding on for dear life, Lev. <laughs> Are you ready for this? This is the easy part, right, Bodhi? Let's count the stairs. One. That's all we need. What was I saying about this being the easy part? I think we're at like 1,062. Yes, <laughs> <laughs> Last count. Hey, that gurgling. That's the volcano. Mm. Holy crap. How's that? It's really stinky. Standing on the edge of an active volcano to hear and feel the Earth's immense power is nothing short of breathtaking. She's lying all the way down there? No. Right. She doesn't want to use her feet, so the way she goes. Hey, work smarter, not harder. Exactly. Woohoo! Well, that was easy. The recent volcanic eruption threw a wrench into our travel plans. Oh, no. It's supposed to be a three hour drive, it's now a five hour yeah. drive, and we just got to that. Mm. Which means it'll be more like a seven hour drive. 
Well, we can just maybe just go through. Can cannot, we just go? Cannot buy. Hmm. <laughs> and after making a couple of friends along the way, we eventually got there. No way. You can't even see the rivers where the waterfalls originate. It's like it's like it's animated. It must be just like underground rivers or something like that. It's literally just spilling out of the side of the soil there. Do you want to get down there to the waterfall? Yeah! One of my favorite things about our travels is that we get to expose Liv and Bodhi to genuine adventures, allowing them to face challenges and experience the satisfaction that comes with real accomplishments. Yeah, it looks like everything is just held up by bamboo and some ropes. Um, I think I should put the camera away because I need all hands. All hands, <laughs> all on, hands deck. on deck. All this right. is crazy. It's so slippery. Oh, right. oh my gosh, we found a monkey. I can't believe we just made that. After repelling down a waterfall, we assumed the worst was over, but turns out we were just getting started. Now that we all zip it up, I think the first challenge is going to be <coughs> crossing this river. Mike, right, remember you did that when we were with the Mentawives. We crossed rivers all day, every day. So we've got this, right? Right? Sadly, it was time for us to wake up from this dreamlike adventure. Though I have a feeling that this is not the end, but merely the beginning. I found these shells. They look incredible. And they're all for you. Thank you, it's a bit stinky. No, it's not. Look. Oh my gosh. <laughs> 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 that is revolting. I'm gonna bring all of these home to smell up our whole house. <laughs> so guys, you are out class. You are going to know that you're going to miss you. Because there is such a beautiful island that I'm going to say that the power that you have spent so much money and traveled so much money to Europe and so much money to go to another country and go to another country, they need to go to Indonesia. अगर खूबसूरती देखनी है तो इंडोनेशिया के अंदर वो कम नहीं है बहुत ज्यादा इंतहा है बहुत मजा आया देखे वाकई कोई शक नहीं है इंडोनेशिया माशाल्लाह बहुत ही ज्यादा खूबसूरत है जो भी बंदा इंडोनेशिया को देखेगा वो एक दफा तो हैरान हो जाएगा यार ये इंडोनेशिया है और इन फैमिली वालों ने कमाल की वीडियो क्रिएट की है आउट ऑफ क्लास उन्होंने वीडियो क्रिएट किया देखकर बहुत मजा आया हमने एंजॉय किया ओके आप लोगों ने भी एंजॉय किया होगा तो आज की दोस्तों को वीडियो अच्छी लगी तो लाइक करना शेयर करना और कमेंट्स करना इसके साथ में जाना और सब्सक्राइब करना और साथ ही इंस्टाग्राम और फेसबुक का लिंक भी नीचे डिस्क्रिप्शन में मौजूद होगा आप जाकर उसको भी फॉलो करें तो मिलते हैं इंशाल्लाह नेक्स्ट वीडियो से अपने हाथ की गाड़ी केयर एंड अल्लाह हाफिज़